Hey guys, I'm going to talk about how I go about quoting a job. It's more for carpenters uh, and builders, and I use certain things that do help me uh, get the quote done more efficiently, and in most cases, charge for that quote. I'm going to start with uh, a little bit of measuring up. Uh, you'll notice here I have this Laika Distro. D8. Now it doesn't matter, you don't have to use one of these. The benefit of this one is, and I'm sure that other brands would have it, is it has a camera in it. Which means essentially, whatever I point it at is where I'm going to measure to. And this is handy when you're out on site and you need to get a measurement for 30 metres or, or 40 metres away and you're trying to look for a little red dot on a laser measure. Mm, it's too hard. The benefit of having one of these instead of taking someone to go and measure with you is it costs you less, you don't need two people to do a quote or a measure up, and you're more accurate with what you do. I also use a, a Samsung uh, phone with a, a little pen in the bottom of it, and as soon as I open that up, it'll automatically uh, start for me, and I can instantly start to write notes down. Uh, it's kind of handy, but I actually find pen and paper still to be pretty good. Uh, and I've got a, an example of a, a deck that I'm just going to show you there. It's simple grid paper. Just want to take my measurements with my laser measurer. I can just draw in whatever it is that I, I need to at a rough scale. And therefore, when I go back to the office, I can just take a photo of that, send it to my computer, and I trace around it uh, uh, in uh, Plus Design Build, which is a piece of software we made. It works inside a SketchUp. And the benefit is when I trace around things, I can see how I'm going to build them and, and the details required, but it'll also do a bill of quantities for me. And that bill of quantities will be turned into a client quote. So therefore I'm not measuring, writing down, creating a spreadsheet, then going and typing out a quote. It's doing that for me as I go. All I need to do is just add in the price of material and labor, and it remembers them for next time. And therefore I can utilize or I can quote very, very quickly. Once I have my quote uh, created and, and I get the client to sign off on that quote, Plus Design Bill will also send it to zero for me. And the benefit of that is, is that I can have my quote in zero and I can figure out how much I allowed for things versus how much they cost as I went and I can figure out whether I actually made money on the job before I started. And that's key guys. What we're doing it for is, yeah, sure we might love building, however, if we're not making good money out of it, like I'm talking 30% net on top of all costs, you know, we might as well go and work for a boss. Uh, and, and quoting's the tough part of it and understanding how you can quote and utilize that quote to charge the client for something. So the reason why a client will pay for a quote is because I'm giving them something so they can see what they're going to get instead of just a piece of paper with text written on it. And that makes a big difference. Clients will happily pay for that. If I don't win the job, I'm char charging for it. I'm charging for it regardless. But if I win the job, I'm actually giving the money back at the end of the job. And therefore, you've locked the client in. They're less likely to go and get 10 different quotes of 10 different builders and you've got a one in 10 chance. You're coming out with something that the client can see, the client can use, they can look at it on their phone. And, uh, and essentially, it's a good way to run your business so you're getting paid to quote at the same time as not getting tie kick is wasting your time. Anyway, guys, I hope this helps out. If you've got any questions, ask them below and I'll do my best to answer. Cheers.